Using an AED requires awareness of some special situations, so you can take appropriate precautions and action. These special situations include using AEDs around water, the age of the victim, trauma, victims wearing medication patches, implanted defibrillators or pacemakers, and do not resuscitate or DNR orders. Whenever water is near a victim of cardiac arrest, move the victim quickly out of standing water, dry the chest, and apply the electrode pads. As long as the chest is dry and the pads are firmly attached to the chest, risk of shock to the rescuer is very low. Cardiac arrest in children is rare and is usually caused by an airway obstruction or breathing problem. In general, no one expects an individual to recognize the exact age of a child. AEDs can safely be used on anyone ages 1 and older. If your device has specialized pediatric pads, use them. Irregular cardiac rhythms like V-fib or VTAC are rarely present in cardiac arrests from trauma. Trauma victims need immediate transport to a trauma center. The cause of cardiac arrest in victims of trauma is not usually associated with a kind of heart rhythm that would be helped with an AED. But when in doubt, it is better to use the AED than not use the AED. No harm will be done by using the AED, but it would be highly unusual for a trauma victim to be saved by the device, unless the cause of the trauma was originally a sudden cardiac event. Remove any medication patches and wipe the skin clean before attaching the AED electrode pads. Modern pacemakers can withstand the shock from an AED without problems. But if you notice an implant like a pacemaker or defibrillator, apply the pads around the implant whenever possible. CPR and AED use can be withheld or discontinued whenever a victim or legal guardian wishes, especially when the victim has a valid do not resuscitate order.